Did Saints Row kill off Marvel's Avengers? In today's most recent video from Slight Stardust, we talk about how fucking insane it is that Saints Row may have actually had a hand in destroying Marvel's Avengers. As you see on screen, this is a pitch that Crystal Dynamics was sending to good old Embracer, basically being like, yo, we'll do War Machine, we'll do Doctor Strange, we'll do Vision, we'll do Captain Marvel, we'll do blah, 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 blah right? And the idea behind that is that essentially, uh, they'll do something, then the other the team will do some it so like this like outsourced team and then it'd be like every four months miller spoke about it right uh but this pitch must have obviously been rejected because marvel's avengers is closing down for good now the reason i say saints row might have something to do with this is this article right here saints row reportedly cost over 100 million dollars to make which is fucking ridiculous listen as someone who actually saw somewhat enjoyed saints row and definitely thought the hate was a bit over the top, I also can understand just how much of a colossal failure this game was, right? Um, since the game sales bombed, Embracer Group is now being more selective with games at green lights. Obviously, you know, essentially being like, what the fuck are you doing? Right, this was a quote they said. To simplify, each project has to earn its right to exist, which means we'll increase our efforts to put quality first even further and make sure we create unique, positive player experiences. Now, Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, if there is a game that <laughs> has not earned its right to live, it's Marvel's Avengers. So obviously, I know <laughs> I'm such a dickhead. I know these are the Steam charts, right? I understand that, like you know, the, the that it's not all the player base, but it's definitely a you know, it's all the numbers we have. It's the only thing we can go off of. They have always been really fucking bad. Even at its peak, it was only 28,000. So, if we go back to this quote, it definitely didn't have, you know, earn its right to exist, which is obviously why Embracer decided to say no to this bad boy right here. So, if you want to blame anyone for the end of uh, Marvel's Avengers, blame Saints Row. <laughs> and that's half a joke and half not. <laughs>